If you practice frustration, stress, victimization, triggered states, that's what your system creates or attracts. So I want to check this idea a little bit deeper and make you realize that what is coming into your life, the emotions, the energetic states that you are in are the result of what you practice the most. Those patterns or those mindsets or energy realities that I'm talking about, for instance, being in a state of frustration, the only reason why you go back to being in a state of frustration is because it's something that you are used to. This state of frustration is a conditioned response to cope to situations that you experienced in the past. The reason why you go back to feeling frustrated or feeling stressed or victimizing or being in a triggered state, feeling triggered by things, is simply because this is what you got used to. So you become the emotions that you practice the most. It means that if those are the emotions that you have been practicing in the past, this is what you are going to fall back to naturally. It means that you are going to create or filter reality through wanting to generate those emotions over and over and over again. You are creating these emotions and the reason why you are creating them over and over again is because those emotions have become comfortable to you. They might not be the best emotions that you can access, they might not be emotions of joy, and happiness, but practicing them brings you back to a place that feels familiar and comfortable. So if you understand this principle, you understand that really, really clearly, you understand also that you are going to attract in your field, you are going to attract experiences, you are going to behave in ways that are going to systematically recreate those emotions because those emotions are your comfort zone. They are the emotions that feel familiar to you. They are the emotions that feel easy. If you tend to be in a frustrated state because this is what you have been practicing over the years, then shifting to be in a state, for instance, of gratitude or lightness or love or acceptance or allowing is going to feel a little bit more difficult and a little bit more artificial and a little bit less easy than just going back to being frustrated. Why? Because you are not used to practicing a state of gratitude. And so naturally you are going to keep on duplicating the broken record of frustration. Once you understand that, once you understand this principle, you realize that you can design the frequencies and the emotions that you want to live in. You are not a victim of your environment. You are not the one who is being impacted by this world. You are impacted by this world because you are attracting those frequencies in your field. But the moment you realize that this is the result of your conditioning, then you start shifting the frequencies. If you want to, if you are tired of being in this cave of frustration, it feels cold. It feels loneliness. It feels lonely. It feels isolated. It feels separated. It feels you know, not generating maybe the kind of vibration and energy that you want to attract into your field. So what naturally is going to happen is that you are going to start generating different mindsets by reconditioning your response to the reality that impacts into your field. So once you understand this principle and you are ready you know, to redesign your mind and redesign your conditioning, then it's a conscious effort or a conscious choice of how you respond to given situations. Sometimes, instead of entering to triggered zone, you can just drop it. You can let it go. You go like, it's not what I was expecting, but I'm not going to attach myself to this reality being different. Okay, it means that you accept and you release control over something that you would like to change. So instead of trying to change, instead of being triggered by what you see, you go like, let's relax, let's drop, let's just go with the flow, let's move to another location, let's change direction, let's change conversation, 
let's not enter into drama right now and let's change my energetic or emotional response to what's happening in my field right now. That makes sense, right? Okay, I'll see you soon for another video.